hi guys welcome and welcome back to my channel today I'll be showing you how I make my baked cheese rice this is actually done with leftover rice or you can cook some fresh rice it's up to you but it's a great side option you can use for dinner or whatever you want to use it for so without further ado guys let's jump right into this video I actually paired mine with some amazing fall of the bone beef ribs so these are the ingredients and they will be listed in the description box along with the measurement. I have some cooked rice. So to a preheated pan, I'll be adding some butter and my sliced onions, some black pepper, red chili flakes and some chicken bouillon, some bell peppers. And I'll give that a stir, allow this to cook for about two minutes, two to three minutes. Some seasoning, these vegetables in a pan because I don't want to fry the rice up. I mean, you can do that too. You can add the rice in here and fry everything up together. I just choose to do it differently today. All right, I have a little bit of broccoli in there. Also, and give that a good stir. Make sure everything is well seasoned and continue to fry this. So to a clean bowl, I'm pouring my white rice. That's my basmati long grain rice. It's leftover that I have from last night or the night before. As I mentioned, you can use leftover rice, you know, or you can cook fresh rice. So I'm going to mix that cooked vegetables in here. Make sure everything is well combined. Looks amazing. And now I'll go in with my cheese. Now, guys, you can choose whatever cheese you want to put, how much cheese you want to put here. There's no measurement. But I did use some smoked Gouda and some cheddar. I love the smokiness of the Gouda. I also did make the smoked Gouda um, cheese sauce. The link for that video will also be in the description box. And there it is. Now, if you don't want your cheese sauce this, this thick, you can add some more milk and you can lighten that up. Again, I chose to do it this way today. Make sure everything is well incorporated together. Looks amazing. Now to my Pyrex dish, I'll spray that with some non-stick cooking spray. And I'll put my rice down. It's kind of like if you're doing noodles, you know, but just that we're doing rice. And you can actually play around with this. You can put some more cheese in the center. You can choose to omit the cheese and just place it on the top. I mean, make it your own, basically. So I top that off with a little bit more smoked gouda and some cheddar. We will bake this until the top is nice and melted and golden. And there it is, guys. It looks amazing. Guys, the crust on this bad boy. Oh, my God. <laughs> guys, you just have to try this one. Please, if you do, let me know how yours turned out. Again, you guys can play around with it. Make it your own. Thank you guys for spending the time with me today. Have a fabulous day. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button, like, share, share, share this video, and comment. All right. See you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.